What's going on everybody? It's your boy Excapar coming back at you guys with another video. I've been getting a decent amount of requests for this video to do a tutorial on this certain topic. So I'm going to show you guys today. Now I'm going to show you guys how to get every single spot as a hotspot so you can shoot so much better. Now you can see or you can tell if there's a hotspot by the little red circle that pops around you in my place. You can see right here in this spot there is no hotspot. But if I come over here to the top of the key, there is a hotspot that you can see that little red ring. Now you'll notice in my non-hotspot area, it's a little bit harder to get green. They don't go in as often. And then when I come over to my actual hotspot area, it's a lot easier. You can see that snap green right there. They're a lot more consistent in the hot zone. Now, you're gonna want to get these hot zones, it's gonna make you shoot a lot better no matter what your archetype is, what position you are, you're gonna want this. Because trust me guys, as a sharp, I've used, look at that, no snap green, but I've used a lot of different plays with a lot of different, you know, uh, hot zones and shit like that with different, you know, shooting percentages. And in all the players where I have my hot spots, you do so much better. I've had games without hotspots where only shoot like 60% and then with my hotspots taking the exact same shots, doing the exact same releases, I shoot like 80 to 90% just because of all the snap greens that I get. Now, in order to get these hotspots back, if you uh, had them and lost them, what you're going to want to do is go over here to options, go on rookie, 12 minute quarters, and then basically you're going to want to go to each spot which i'll show you what those spots are and shoot up five to ten shots and try to make at least up to percent of them now a lot of people go to the shot chart right here and think that you know oh they're all red that's my hot spots do not use this as an indication for the hot spots and which ones are your hot spots what you want to do is use this as an indication for the different zones so you can see this is the corner all the top uh, three points the inside the closer and then right finally inside the paint use these so you know where you should be shooting from and then go on to the court as well as you see my my court go on here and see where you have hot spots and where you don't but anyways guys i'm gonna show you a few clips of me going for this it's pretty easy to get it just takes a really long time after every game come to your my court shoot around maybe go into a pro arena and see where your hot spots are to keep track of the camera but don't go to that chart but anyways guys let's get right into it all right guys so basically you want to do what i just said you'll see in these clips i'm running to each of the spots that i don't have which are the left wing and some of the left mid range as well as the left corner and i'm just going to that left side i'm stealing the ball and i'm just shooting from those spots every single time now you'll see only a few shots from the games that i played but what i tried to do was take between five to ten shots probably ten so I wanted to get the most and then move on to the next spot so I got the wing you know hit about 10 shots or like an entire quarter out of the four I just hit that left wing instead of attacking it then the second quarter you know I'd go and I'd attack that left corner and the third I attack those uh, mid-range spots and I just keep doing that over and over again in every single game for all the different spots that I needed to get until I have all my red spots now to check it, you want to go back into your court right here and just walk around. So you see, I'll start in the left corner from three. You see, that's red, and I'll walk around. And every single spot here is now red. Come in here, that's for mid-range. Come around, every single spot is now red. And now inside the paint, that's the only hotspot I don't have right now. I'm about to play another game and get that done. But it's super easy, guys. It took me maybe three, four games to get them all done. And I'm only playing on five-minute quarters. If you guys do this on 12, I guarantee you guys that you'll get this done in maybe two, three games. It's going to take me about six on five-minute quarters just because I'm lazy and I don't feel like doing 12-minute games. But anyways, guys, if you enjoyed this video, please drop a like down below. And if you're new, of course, subscribe. Leave down below in the comments what you want to see in the next video. It's been Exitar, guys, and I'll see you in the next video.